Hi, I'm Jay. I'm with the green team. It's Jennifer and I who got on The Biggest Loser season 11. Um, I really came to Biggest Loser thinking that I was here to lose weight and in the whole medical testing I had a big surprise that I really didn't know about was the fact that I had what was called a, a uh, I think it's a tachycardia arrhythmia, um, potentially fatal arrhythmia that I had never been diagnosed with before, knew nothing about. And it scared Dr. Huizenga a lot. Uh, in fact, it was pretty much touch and go whether or not I was going to even get on the show. Um, but I went through all kinds of cardiac testing, all kinds of things for them to try to figure out what it was that was causing this. And as it turned out, through the sleep test, it appear, appeared that I have sleep apnea. Not only did I have it, but I had it pretty bad. So um, what had happened was I got the opportunity to get my CPAP machine. Uh, that we affectionately here call on the ranch, uh, Pappy. And for me, it's, it's really saved my life. Um, it's the reason I was able to get on the show, because without my CPAP machine, they would have never allowed me to be on the show. And it's helped me sleep better. It's increased my metabolism. Uh, and most importantly, the arrhythmia has gone away. And Dr. Heisinga thinks that the reason that I had this arrhythmia is because I wasn't getting sleep every night. My heart was always still beating harder than it needed to and it constantly put my heart at stress every single night. And I always thought I was what I called functionally fat. Uh, I was always overweight, but I could get around, I was fine. Um, I never needed a lot of sleep, and in my family, kind of people that sleep, uh, who tended to sleep a lot, were lazy. So for me, it was like a badge of honor, like, oh, I don't need much sleep. And so I'd fall asleep at night, maybe two hours, and wake up and go back to sleep for a couple hours. And for me, I thought that was normal. And I might sleep maybe three or four hours a night, um, but never in a row, even at that. Little did I know that it was really the fact that I had sleep apnea. I've had it, I guess, for years. I never realized it. And it was more than just not getting good night's sleep. It was really affecting my heart overall. So thanks to this opportunity to get on The Biggest Loser, thanks to everything that was done help, to help me medically, I now have had the benefit of having not only dropped a ton of weight while I'm here, but I'm sleeping five, six hours a night straight. I mean, I've not slept eight hours straight. I don't know if I can do that. It might just be the way my, my body works. But when I go to sleep at night, I get five to six hours solid sleep. I wake up, I'm rested. When we have to work out, I'm not tired. I'm not dogging it in my workout. So it's definitely changed my life. How long I'll have to have the CPAP machine, I don't know. But the way I look at it for me, uh, it's saved my life and it's also really been a driver for my metabolism. I think a lot of people don't really realize that in addition to getting good night's sleep, if you're sleeping well, your metabolism works so much better. And I think that's the real reason why I've been able to have such great weight loss success here. So whatever you do, if you have an opportunity to get a sleep test, get one, find out about it. I had no idea that I had sleep apnea. Probably tens of thousands, millions of people don't realize it. So it's going to help your heart, it's going to help you live longer, and for anybody who wants to lose weight, it's going to help you lose weight and potentially a lot of weight.